The Enforcement Directorate is currently carrying out searches at residence of Hero Moto Chairman Pawan Manjal in a money laundering probe. Pawan Manjal's residence is being searched in New Delhi by the Enforcement Directorate. The probe is based on a case filed by the Directorate of Revenue Intelligence, DRI. DRI, which earlier apprehended a close aide of Pawan Manjal at the airport with huge amounts of foreign currency at the airport last year. The Income Tax Department then conducted search operations at 25 locations linked to Hero Moto Corp as part of a tax evasion investigation against the firm. Let me cut across to Manish Pandey, tracking the ED for us. Manish, tell us more on the raids on Hero Moto Corp Chairman Pawan Manjal. Well, Nabila, what we do know at this point of time is that the Enforcement Directorate is conducting searches at multiple locations in Delhi NCR, including the premises of uh, Hero Motors chairman uh, in the national capital. Now, as far as ED's case is concerned, we have been given to understand is that the ED's case is based on the investigation which is being carried out by DRI. Last year, DRI had apprehended a person who was uh, allegedly linked to Pawan Munjal and that is when the DRI filed a charge sheet. Based on that DRI charge sheet, the ED has started a money laundering investigation against Hero Motors including Pawan Munjal. As far as uh, these raids are being conducted, the Enforcement Directorate claims that they have come across certain evidence in the case and that is why to recover more documentary evidence, to recover more evidence, they are conducting these searches. As far as the probe agencies are concerned, remember last year the Income Tax Department had conducted searches at more than 25 premises linked to Hero Motors across country but now the ED's investigations appears to be focused on Pawan Munjal and that is why his premises in the national capital is being searched as we speak. Nabila. Right, uh, Manish, give us, uh, give us more updates on one of uh, Pawan Munjal's close aid being caught at an airport with large amounts of foreign currency. Uh, we believe an investigation was launched back then itself. What did they find out of it? Well, Nabila, what we do know at this point of time is that uh, a person who was allegedly close to Pawan Munjal, that person was travelling out of country. That is when the DRI officials, including the airport authority officials, they got to know about a huge amount of foreign currency being transported from India to outside country and it was suspected at that point of time. DRI was informed, the DRI officials started investigation in the case and that is when they learned that this person has linked with uh, uh, Hero Motors, this person has linked with uh, Pawan Munjal. At this point of time, these are merely allegations, but the ED believes that uh, based on the DRI charge sheet, they were in a position to lodge a case in this case and ECIR was lodged by the Enforcement Directorate and now a search is being conducted at multiple places including the residence of uh, uh, Pawan Munjal in National Capital. Tell us more on the, uh, on the Hero Motor Corp Chairman Pawan Munjal. Um, in fact, we know that this is a, a firm which has been which is reputed. And in terms of the merit of this company itself, has there been any past uh, dubious activities that we know of? Well, as far as Zero Motors is concerned, remember it is a very prestigious firm. It is involved in two wheelers. Uh uh, manufacturing and it is one of the leading firms in country as far as two wheelers are concerned. As far as Pawan Munjal is concerned, in past there were no certain allegations of fraud or tax evasion by this firm or Pawan Munjal. But everything started when the DRI got hold of a person who was uh, allegedly close to Pawan Munjal and Hero Motors and that is when the DRI started its investigation. Also, there was a suspicion last year that a tax evasion is being carried out by Hero Motors and that is when the Income Tax Department started their own investigation, own probe in the case. When the, in, uh, uh, when the Income Tax Department started their probe, they got allegedly some evidence of tax evasion. The legal proceedings regarding that tax evasion by Hero Motors or Pawan Munjal, it is still being carried out by the Income Tax Department. As far as Enforcement Directorate is concerned, as per 
the predicate offense the enforcement directorate cannot lodge an ecir or in layman language we can say fir till the time there is a predicate offense and that is when uh, that is why when dri started their investigation ed never lodged an ecir but when a charge sheet was filed then ed took a predicate offense of that charge sheet and that is when ed started their probe now, i spoke to several officials in the enforcement directorate what we have been given to understand is that these searches are being carried out after ed was in position with certain evidence in the case and after going through those evidence it was uh, necessary according to enforcement directed for the officials to carry out searches to recover more evidence in the case and that is why multiple places are being uh, raided as we speak now as far as the corporate industry is concerned it is it has uh, sent shock waves across many industries many corporate industries including the automobile um, uh, companies as far as pawn munjal is concerned he is a reputed person but now ed Absolutely. search is being carried out it is going to be of difficult course, for him you know for, uh, for sure and the impact we see already uh, taking on the stock market we see that the domestic automobile major has had a hit with its stocks post the information of raids coming out but this is uh, a case of money laundering that money could be diverted and this is precisely what the ED in is investigating at the moment if you like the video do like comment share and subscribe